Duke. What? What happened to the rest of my I, cupcakes? I don't know. That's all there was when I came in here. I you didn't, didn't touch, touch one of them. I didn't touch a one of them. Hmm. Those were for church. I want to start out by saying I am here against my will. I think I think Luna May ate some of his cupcakes and he's blaming me. So he's making me do this to pay for some cupcakes. Now this is sayings, beliefs, and legends in the Ozark where I was born and raised. I remember when there was just two cabins in the whole Ozarks and you stood on one side of the holler and you hollered at people and that was our telephones back then. All right, let's get started. Now this is beliefs and superstitions. If you get wet while hand washing dishes, you'll marry a drunk. <laughs> you'll pee the bed if you play in the fire. This is true. Isn't that right, Lou May? Never eat both ends of a loaf of bread before finishing the middle. Otherwise, you won't be able to make ends meet. On New Year's Day, eat black-eyed peas for good luck and collard greens for money all year long. Oh, that doggone clock every time. How many ribbons you break when opening wedding gifts is how many children you're going to have. Wow. Women should never put their purse on the floor or they'll go broke. Especially in my house. <laughs> okay. Your mama will have a stroke if a baby gets their hair cut before their first birthday. This is true. Hold your breath when passing a graveyard so spirits can't jump in, in you. Little May, want to go for a ride? Wash your hair in the first rain of May to make it grow faster. Open the window when someone dies in a home so its spirit can escape and it's not trapped in that house. A bird in the house foretells a death in the family. If wind blows smoke down the chimney, bad weather's on its way. And this is true. We used to have an old wood stove, and I'd go outside and watch the smoke rise. If the smoke went straight up, the weather was going to be mild. There's a lot of times I went out, and the smoke would be coming from the chimney and going down the roof of the house to the ground. Wasn't a day we had snow. So this is true. Never leave a rocking chair rocking by itself because it's bad luck. If the sun shines during a rain shower, it's foretold that the devil's wife is crying. If you're fishing, don't stop to count how many fish you caught that day because you'll never catch another one. If you bite your tongue while eating, that means you've recently told a lie. A knife placed under the bed during childbirth will ease the mother's labor pains. This I don't know anything about. If an unborn child kicks the left-hand side of the womb, it's going to be a boy. Never buy your boyfriend or husband shoes as a gift because he'll walk out of your life with them and that new jacket you bought him. <laughs> uh, if you allow children to sweep the floor, they'll sweep up unwanted guests. Dreaming of fish means that someone's pregnant. Never bring an old broom to a new house. That, 
and when you move, don't bring the broom you had in that house to that one. That means you're bringing old trash to a new house. If your nose is itching, it means company is coming. Always go out. When you go to visit somebody, always go out the same door that you came in. If you don't, you're going to have bad luck. Never transplant a small cedar tree because when the shadow of that tree gets big enough to cover your grave, you'll die. Now this is just belief. A sputtering fire with no apparent cause was said to signal the family fight between two members within the next 24 hours. When visiting a neighbor's house, a mountain dweller made sure to leave by the same door he originally entered to avoid bad luck. I think I just told you that. An Ozark superstition proclaimed that a neighbor should immediately stop the clock upon a passing to prevent another death in the household within the year. All the mirrors in the house would be covered with white cloth to prevent the reflection of, of mourners since it was believed that a person reflected in the house of mourning would not live beyond the next year. A girl who caught her squirt, skirt, skirt, not squirt, sorry, a girl who caught her skirt frequently on briars was soon to catch a husband, whereas a girl who rode a mule would never marry. Why, well, I'd be a little bit wondering if she's catching her skirt on briars a lot, why is she doing out in the briar patch? I think that's what she's doing out there trying to catch her husband. Three candles or lamps placed accidentally in a row signal there would soon be a marriage within the family. Finding two snakes in the house, a bird, a bird, a less pleasant coincidence symbolized the same event. Means the same event would happen twice within a year in your house. I think I'm going to let that go. I think that paid for the cupcakes that a loony may ate, and I got blamed for. Uh, that old Rusty now, he can be mean little devil when he wants to be. won't let me have one of them cupcakes. We'll see y'all later.